This program contains strong language and sexual references throughout. Yeah. Feeling slightly awkward. I've been a bit busy in the villa already. And he's pretty hot. Hey. Cammy, God damn. Finally, some new cock in the house. Megan. I'm so fucking relieved. So how is everything? Everything's good. How are you? Yeah, not too bad. Hey, it's good to see Megan. She looks gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Seem a bit shy. It's a familiar face. I thought I'd feel at home. This is not home. I've seen you for a while, Stephen. Yeah, it's been a long time, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know why Meg won't even look at me. It's all just gone really awkward. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait till we talk about all our bedtime stories. Uh. Yeah, I look forward to hearing everything. What's going on? A lot. <laughs> Go on, let me in on some secrets. He's your ex, not mine. <laughs> yeah, you tell it, Meg. Um, yeah, it's fine. I, I kind of got with someone. Are you fucking serious? This is like your worst nightmare come true. Oh my god! <laughs> Awkward. Yeah, basically, the person that she slept with, Jordan, I'm seeing in the house. Okay. I'm gutted. Meg Reese has got with Jordan. It's just fucked my head up, but it means that she can't argue with anything I do. So I'm looking forward to getting the villa and just tear shit up. What are you doing? Me and Meg, obviously, we have been getting quite, quite, quite close. <laughs> Bloody hell! Didn't expect that, to be honest. We haven't slept together, but oh, this is fucking weird. He genuinely fancies that girl. He's looking at her like thinking, "Fuck me, bend over, babe. I want to fuck ya." Last yeah. time I saw him, he said, Chain. I have, I have. I need to check up on him. Oh, fuck's sake. I think Megan's feeling a bit nervous, as she's not going to want to like me getting attention off another girl. And I think she does feel a bit threatened, as I've only known Megan, what, four or five days. I was on my ex, you know, we've got history. Say it then, Jordan. You said you'd say the truth, so say the truth. I have said, I said we'd be getting, we'd getting together, obviously. We haven't slept together, we'd be doing stuff. We spent like four nights together on that. What would, you, what would you call it? I'd say it was like seeing each other. It's sort, of, sort of like seeing each other, yeah, but... I think it's pretty obvious from his reaction that uh, it's probably not as intense as what she thinks it is. He said that, well, obviously, when someone comes in, he wouldn't um, give him the time of day, basically. She's a psycho. <laughs> Whatever. I know Jordan better than anyone, so I know what he's like. I don't want to make you feel awkward, but obviously you've got to remember we've lived in a house with each other for quite a long time now, so... Well, like a week. Yeah, but when you're living in... I've known him for, like, four years. OK. Right, there's no need to be rude then. Oh, fuck. She seems to think he's some sort of fucking girlfriend of his, but we'll see what happens. Obviously got feelings, so... Well, you obviously do, don't you? We do, yeah. As soon as she walks in, he completely acts different. My gut was always right. When someone dumps it, just shake it on the chin. Oh, you dumped me, really? How cute are you? Are you um, how cute am I? You let me fuck you up the ass the first time I met you, you little slut. Oh, did I? Yes. Yeah. Really? Of course. Because I never got fucked up the ass ever until you fucked me over. <laughs> I fucked you over? I'll split up with you. Oh, did you? Yeah. Well, let's let the dirty secrets come out then. She is a fucking lunatic. You fuck fucked up. up. Well, I fucked up losing you. Look at you. You are a crazy fucker. You were powerful, but when I met you, you are just fucked now. What happened to you? I see those man titties. They look real cute, boo -boo. Man titties? What do you want about you? These titties? are pecs, mate. I'm fucking no, powerful. No, boo boo. Yeah? Those are man titties. Taking estrogen? I'm even scared to even talk to her, even look at her. She thinks I think, what the fuck's she gonna do to me? Fuck off now. Go on. I'm pissed off with you. Fuck I'm off. Pissed. It's so good. Go on, yeah. Fuck off. I mean it now. Two years I've perfected how to be calm and stuff like that. Within two seconds, she's made me fucking lose everything. Fuck off. Oh, fuck up. No, guess what? I'm here to stay, bitch. Wait, by the way, I've got some sick bird with me. This tattoo model, but a little bit better than you. And there's a spare bed opposite me. You can sit up and watch me polar light out for the last three nights. Nothing, considering you can't get it up half the time. Oh, fuck off, you You said it was too big to sit on. She's bringing the badness out of me. She knows how to fucking do it. Don't come at me with your damn bullshit, all right? You're still living in daddy's backyard. Of course I am, because he looks after me. Oh, yeah, because you're a grown-ass man and you have your dad fucking taking care of you. Of course. I am one spiteful fucking bitch, and if you fuck with me, I will ruin your life and your extended family's life. Well, I'm going to leave you with this Right. Run along, boo-boo. Boo-boo, fuck off. Run I'm going to go shit in your bed, you 